I'm Brian King here at the Nitro Pit in Surprise, Arizona. I'm here with Trevor Clement. How do you like this track, Trevor? I love it. You know, we're running it dry, blue groove, lots of traction, super fast. It's been a lot of fun so far. How long have you been racing out here? Uh, we've been racing out here since it opened back in uh, December of 2006. I've uh, been racing Nitro itself for almost three years. Oh, wow. Now, you actually helped build this track. I did, with the help of uh, Todd Jonas, Ross Denny, and uh, Kenny Brosh. We, uh, a bunch of locals, uh -huh. we, uh, we got this thing done in about two months. The need to race uh, overwhelmed us, so we looked for the right location, Speed World was it, and uh, let us do what we wanted to do, so we built our dream track. You know, we've had a good time. We've been doing this for, uh, for quite a while. I knew if I was gonna get out of the house when uh, he was five, you know, that I better take him with me, uh, with the wife and everything. So uh, he's been at my side ever, ever since, you know. Yeah, he's my best buddy, uh, my best friend. Hey, the first year I came out and really got serious about racing and started traveling the nation. And found myself traveling to California quite a bit. And I thought, you know what? They had a real nice track out there, so let's build one of these in our backyard so we don't have to travel. We said, you know what, we really need to step up the scene in Arizona and we wanted to uh, help the RC scene grow. We wanted to do what we could to create a facility for people to race and uh, people to play. You know, guys look forward to coming out to the track. Uh, I've got kids racing that, uh, I guess my youngest is five years old right now. Anyone from uh, five years old to, you know, I've probably got people racing in their you know, early 70s. You know, it's it's kind of interesting. I love racing. Uh, I've got some great companies that support me, like Kyosho and Sidewinder uh, and the Nitro Pit One Hobbies. So I love to go out there and I love to race. But when it's my race day at the Nitro Pit, uh, you know, these guys drive from all over the nation, sometimes all over the world. And, and like I said before, I mean, those guys come here and I want them to feel like they're the most important person on earth, whether it's you know, the biggest pro or, uh, you know, a new time, first time out guy, you know, I just, I feel like I can give them back a little bit and uh, make them the rock star, which they put a lot of work into these things. They deserve it. So. The, the track is awesome. It's, I've been fortunate to drive to a lot of different tracks in the country, almost all of them. And this is one of the best facilities you're going to find in the country. How about the people here? The people here are the best. They're, they're all enthusiasts. They're in it for the right reason. Uh, the guys that own the track and run the track are also racers, and uh, it doesn't get much better than that because they relate to the needs of what we have, you know, our needs. They can relate to what uh, what the racer wants to see in a track. So they put all of the best features that they could imagine into this track. One of the nicest facilities in the country. I'm a local out here, so I love it. It's an awesome track. It's the best track in the country, in my opinion. Oh, I've raced uh, all over the western United States. I mean, there are a lot of other really nice tracks, but we're really lucky out here in Arizona to finally have a facility that I would consider a national world quality track.